Hi, Patrick here, and this is a demo of eLoud, a package for eSpeak that um, reads text interactively. So I'm just going to walk you through uh, what eLoud does, and then I'm going to tell you a little bit about how to get a hold of it. So um, basically, the way eLoud works is once you turn it on, yeah, on, as you move around inside Emacs, uh, eLoud will read along with you. So if you go to the very beginning of a file, this buffer is for notes you don't want to save and for list evaluation. If you want to create a file, visit that file with CFC and read the and enter the text in that file zone buffer. Uh, if you move along one character at a time, semicolon, T H I S B U F F E R I S, it'll read uh, that character with you. If you move by a word, it'll move. It'll read that, that word to you. For notes, you don't want to save. You can go back. Save to want D don. Um, if you move to the beginning of a line, it'll read you that line. This buffer is for notes you don't want to. If you want to create a file, visit that, then enter the text in that file zone buffer. If you're in the middle of a line, then, then, enter, um, then it'll in. read from that point. A file, visit that file with CXCF. Um, so as you're typing as well, it, uh, it'll read the characters that you type. D A I S this. I S is A A D E S D dot. H -E -L -O. And as you finish a word Hello. and press space, it'll read you the word. F O M from E L O U D dot. Okay. Loud. If you delete text, it'll read that as well. Hello, Hello from loud. Dot e -S -E -T. Um, And if you delete back to the be very beginning of a file, S -I -H -T. Semi -semi 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 beginning of buffer. Beginning of buffer. Give you a little warning that you're at the beginning. Same at the end. End of buffer. End of buffer. End of buffer. This is A. D. I. Okay, so um, op if you're opening files, it'll also read you um, the mini buffer down there. Find file. Okay. So say we want to find um, some kind of text file to read. B. O. O. K. So if I press tab to complete. Possible completion. Book.db book slash. It'll read the uh, possibilities. And then if there's only one possibility, poss possibility it'll fill it in and read. That um that output. S books. D R I D E. So let's open a text file and sort of explore around in the text file. So and we're gonna open Pride and Prejudice, the novel. Pride and Prejudice Okay. So now that we're in um we're in this file, we can also move by a sentence. By Jane Austen. Chapter one. It is a truth universal. It is a truth universally acknowledged that a single man in possession of a good fortune must be in want of a wife. However little known the feelings of you, however little known the feelings of you of such a man may be on his first entering a neighborhood, this truth is so well fixed in the minds of the surrounding families that he is. You can also go back. It is a truth universally acknowledged that a single man in possession of a good fortune must be in want of. Okay, um, so also the if you use the spell check feature in Emacs, um, Eli will read out the possibilities. So say if we enter a um, F word that's incorrect. O F F O F O. The sofa, zero, FIFO, one half, two, fossil, three halves, four five, five fluff, six, the sofa, the sofa, F, O, O, F. Foof, zero food, one goof, two foo, three so let's food, choose four foot, five food, food, zero. Food. And replaces it. Foo, food. And you can also do the MX, whole um I, the whole file. S B E L L neighborhood. Zero neighborhood. One neighborhood. So right there two it's neighborhood. correcting neighborhood, the British spelling of neighborhood to the American spelling. Bennett, zero, Bennett, one, Bennett, doesn't Bennett, like the, two, the Bennett, proper name three, Bennett. Bennett, four, Bonnet, five, Bennett, six, Bender, seven. Okay. Um, so uh, there is already a uh, screen reader for Emacs. It's called Emacs Speak. So why would you use eLoud instead of Emacs Speak? So uh, eLoud and Emacs Speak are sort of meant for different audiences. Um, eLoud is really meant more for um, people who have low vision or eye strain, so the people who still want to navigate Emacs um, using vision, so to some extent at least, uh, and you know to that end, you know you can turn eLoud off and on. eLoud off, eLoud on. So eLoud is a minor mode for Emacs, so that means you can it can be turned on or off in any buffer. Um, whereas um, Emacs Speak it, it has its own separate um, distribution, uh, and you, you so basically if you use Emacs Speak, uh, you have to have the speech on all the time. So Emacs Speak is really recommended for somebody who really only ever wants to use Emacs with speech. Um, also, eLoud may be a little easier to get installed than Emacs Speak. Um, but on the other hand, Emacs Speak will handle more 
um, sort of weird situations, edge cases. And there still are a, a bunch of things that eLoud won't read aloud to you. Um, so if you, if you use eLoud um, you find, and you find bugs, or if you want a feature that should be added, uh, please open an issue on the GitHub repository. Uh, and let me know what you think.